everybody, I'm a boy and today I'm going to draw a Megalodon. Now you must be wondering what is a Megalodon. It's one just an extinct shark. So we are going to draw that today. First of all, I'm going to draw the head of the Megalodon. Okay, so let's start. I'm going to draw a huge, enormous, gigantic circle. As Megalodon's heads are very large and huge. This is just a guide, okay? So, if, even if you draw it not perfect, still. But if you want to draw it perfect, you can use points, lids or anything which you have circular in shape. Now, draw a sloping line starting from here, connecting to the circle. And the more sloping you draw, the more tilted the Megalodon will be. Okay. So now make, now connect these two from here. Okay. Now draw a sloping line from here. Put the dorsal pin. Okay, now draw these lines for the fins, okay. Okay, now we are going to draw a guide, okay, now this is just a line, okay, because we want to draw the jaw and we are going to make our Megalodon opening the jaw, okay. Now draw a, a real, little bit pointy triangular shape, okay, for the nose tip, okay, okay. Now let's draw the cotyl fin of the Megalodon. Okay. And now we are going to draw the cotyl fin, okay? Triangular in shape. And see. It's like this, okay? And now we are going to continue this line. And we are going to make a triangle shape. Okay. Now that is for the guidelines. Let's start on the final drawing. Okay, now draw an oval for the Megalodon's eye. Draw an apostrophe for the nostril. Okay. Now draw a few horizontal lines over here for the wrinkles. Now, now make an you know we can curve from here for the Megalodon strong jaw and now take another line here for the gums draw several triangular shaped teeth okay this should be very you know triangular okay and they should be sharp okay and they are and this will be pointy at the tip. Okay. Because Megalodon teeth are very sharp. They are razor sharp. Okay. And now add lots of teeth over here. Okay. And now as you see that we have added the teeth. Now we are going to make the petrol fin. Okay. Let's finish the guide for the petrol fin. Okay. Now the petrol fin is very large. Okay. And we are going to draw it. Means this is an C shape okay to finish the petrol fin okay and now we are going to do the rest for all of the fins okay but we have already finished this fin so we are not going to do anything to that fin. now we are going to do the same over here and and as you see that we have now completed it just we have just erase the guides okay now we are going to erase this half circle okay yes and now, and be careful, the nostril should not be erased, okay? Neither the lines, okay? And as you see that, that now see, now see, and now see, and this should be less pointy, okay? Okay, and now as you see that, we are going to erase the actual mouth, okay? Because that was just a guide, let's erase that. Okay. Read or any of the final sketches. Okay. Now we are going to erase this much.
much okay we are going to erase this much and yes erase this much part and this much part because this all are guides okay um now we are, we are just going to you know now we are going to add in and slant line coming from the nose tip to separate the upper you know means you know the upper part and the lower part now let gently color this much area okay and if you want if you don't want to color with the pencil you can also color it with your color pencils or oil pastels or watercolor anything which you have okay and i'm just going to color with the pencil because it it looks nice and you can even if the color goes out of the medium i can erase it so that's but you can use anything if you wish okay and let's color this much part now slowly 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 we are going to color the pectoral fins okay pectoral fins are going to be colored and now add a light value okay rather than a dark value okay Oh, it's so impressive that the Magellanon is a huge shark. You know, Magellanons have a teeth measuring up to seven inches. That's very long. Okay, they are even three times longer than great white shark too. Okay, so now. page so it's easier to color the dots and things okay okay now color okay okay now color it color this much part okay now we are left only with this pen okay and now we are going to color this cotton pen okay But Magellanons have a white underbelly. Okay, so don't color this much part. Okay, accidentally. Now we are we are going to color the jaw, the jaw of the Magellanon. But just don't color these teeth. Okay, as Magellanon teeth are white in color, just like humans and great white shark. So just don't color this teeth. Okay. Color only the jaw and you know the inside of his mouth, but not the teeth. Okay. We have colored this much part. Now be dark while you are coloring this much part. Okay. as there is nothing inside the mouth okay our magellanon is ready okay so bye give me likes and subscribe my channel no dislikes okay and as you see that the magledon head is very popular okay okay so bye